Hello everyone, Dragon14 here. The best of us make mistakes, and I'm talking about mistakes with our command block inventions. It happens to the best of us, but it mostly happens to beginners. So if you're a beginner at commands and your command does not work, does the complete opposite of what you tell it to do, and is just straight out broken, then you might want to consider five factors which may be breaking your contraption. The most common one is order of operations. If I want to summon a firework and then teleport a zombie downwards, then the order which I write that is actually very important. So, this isn't working. Why? Because the, com the machine reads these in a certain order. In this case, it's teleporting the zombie and then summoning a firework, which we do not want. So we all we have to do is swap those commands around and suddenly, we have a working command. Now, how do you know what these operations are? Well, you can A, read them on the screen, or I'll just explain them to you right now. So, when I am activating commands in a positive di X direction, you can do this by pressing F3 and facing a direction, and the fourth line from the bottom will tell you which way you're facing. So, East, positive X, when you activate commands at the same time, it will do the one closer to negative Z, and then it will do the one closer to positive Z, and then it will move up in the X axis and do the same thing. And when it runs out of command blocks, it will go all the way back to the start and do the same ones again, but one block up. So the ones that are higher up will be done last, and the ones that are further in the positive X and positive Z direction will all be done last. So negative ones come first is what you should take away from this. The second reason why your commands not, might not work is basic syntax. If you type this in, then it's unfortunately it's not going to summon a zombie, I am sorry to tell you. You must do it the specific way that it wants. So summon zombie, and you must put in all three coordinates. So if I take this one out, it will not know what I'm saying. Actually, it does, but it just ignores the coordinates altogether. So we plop that in, and it gets summoned to where I want it to be summoned. By the way, if you are confused about syntax, you just type in whatever command it is you want and then type in help right next to it and it will give you the syntax. So, play sound, help, and it will give you how to write the command just in case you make these mistakes or do not have access to the wiki at that particular time. Now, the next reason why things might not work, this has got to do with the at r tag. Now, when you're using the at r tag, which just means random entity, or random player, it will not work if you do not specify the type. Here I've specified the name, but it doesn't know what it's looking for, so it automatically assumes that it's looking for a player. Now there are no players here called why not, but there are three armor stands. So when I press this button, nothing happens, but here I have actually specified the type, so type equals armor stand. So I press this button here, and then suddenly you have a working command and a working randomizer. The fourth reason why things might not be working is unbalanced brackets, lack of colon, and unbalanced quotations. If you type this in, it will just not know what to do altogether. So make sure, and it will even tell you in the previous output section, but make sure you balance your quotations like that, you divide your variables like that, and you put in your curly brackets, make sure they're balanced. If you have one on the left side, then you must have one on the right side. They are the same, and you can see it works. Now the last reason why your commands not be working is concerning executed entities with a score. So, the, I've scored all these, one, two, three, four, and five. If I type in, say, at a score, it won't work, minimum equals three, then it will, it will select all entities that have a score of at least three and above. So in this case, three, four, and five, and I can prove that by pressing this button. If I write score equals 3, then it will select all entities that have a score 3 and below. So if I press this button, then it picks, this, picks the armor stands 1, 2, and 3. So, I hope at least one of you has taken something away from this. If you're a beginner at commands and they're just not working, don't give up. Consider these five factors, and if they're still not working, just keep going at it. Never give up. 